friends, my name is Christina. Thanks for joining us for Kid Point Online. Today, we are exploring a book in the Old Testament called Esther. It's about a woman named Esther. God used Esther in an amazing way and chose her to help save and protect her people. Her story shows us that God always has a plan even when things seem hard or confusing. Bottom line, God always has a plan for me. Before we jump into our story, it's time to worship. So everyone stand up on your feet and let's get ready to praise Jesus.
came to light I believe it, I believe it, yeah You spoke my name and my heart came to life I believe it, I believe it, yeah I wanna sing about it, I wanna scream and shout it I'm gonna sing it right now who lived in Persia during the reign of King Xerxes. Esther was adopted by her relative, Mordecai, hey. who worked in the palace of the king. Once, Mordecai had even saved the king's life. Yep. Esther became the queen of Persia, but no one knew she was a Jew because Mordecai told her to keep it a secret. This is Haman. Yeah. <laughs> who was the second most powerful man in Persia. <coughs> Haman hated Mordecai because Mordecai wouldn't bow down to him. So Haman convinced King Xerxes to make a decree to kill all Mordecai's people, the Jews. When Mordecai learned about this, he was very upset, as were all the Jews in Persia. When Queen Esther's servants came and told her about how upset Mordecai was, she sent one of her servants, Haytak, to go to Mordecai and find out what was troubling him. So Haytak went out to Mordecai, and Mordecai told him of the plan to kill God's people. Mordecai said that he wanted Esther to go to the king to ask for him to save the Jews. Esther knew that anyone who went to the king without being called could be put to death. 
but Mordecai reminded Esther that she may have been made queen for such a time as this. So Esther asked for the Jews to pray for her and fast for three days. Then Esther put on her royal robes and went before the king. When the king saw Esther, he was happy to see her and asked, What do you want, Queen Esther? I will give it to you, even if it's half the kingdom. So Esther asked the king if he and Haman would come to a banquet that she had prepared for them, and the king agreed. Esther held a banquet and then asked the king and Haman to come to a second banquet the next night. That night, the king was reminded of how Mordecai had once saved his life. King Xerxes decided that he must honor Mordecai and that Haman would help. Then at the second banquet, Esther told the king about the plot against her people. The king was angry and asked, who would do such a thing? Esther said it was Haman and the king ordered Haman to be killed on that very night. Uh oh. But the decree to kill all the Jews was still in place and the Jews were still in danger. So Mordecai asked the king to issue a new decree so that the Jews could defend themselves. The king did, and the Jews defeated all their enemies. God's people were saved and celebrated their great victory. <laughs>